Yo, 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 welcome back. Right, what happened in the last part was we saw from a distance a big shadowy cloud thing attacking this this building, and we heard Rusty screaming. So I think we're gonna go and f see what happened to him. There's a manuscript page over here, so I'm gonna. Whoa! Oh my god. Don't you just hate that in games like this? When you when you think nothing's there and then someone just sparks in your face and then it makes you jump. Like I probably just did by saying sparks. Right, manuscript page. Read it. Rusty attacked by the dark presence. Yes, we know. The visitor center was sturdy, but the impact turned the front of the building into splinters. Rusty was thrown across the lobby like a rag doll and hit the far wall hard. It didn't hurt until he tried to move and saw his leg bend the wrong way. Felt the broken rib stabbing him on the inside. Rusty howled in pain and fear, suddenly afraid to die alone. Aww. Got to feel sorry for him. Seemed an alright guy. The Can we go in here? Office was locked. I'd need a key to get in. Why would I want to go in there anyway? Seriously. What's around here? Oh, it's a th coffee thermos. Nice. I don't think I've found that one before either. Alright, what else is around here? Nothing. Okay, I have to go in the house now. Oh wait, there's a door. I'm gonna look in here. Another coffee coffee thermos. How convenient. Ben will jump out of these barrels, I swear. Anything up there? No. Alright. Light switch doesn't work. And there's a gate over there, I'll go in there later. Right. Let's go in this visitor centre. Wow, I really did a number on it. Look at that. Car through it. Right. Hello? Back here. I'm back here. Hey, please help me. Wait your turn. I wanna see if I've, if there's anything. Uh uh, I didn't wanna go over there yet. Oh, well. Hi Rusty. Oh god. You're beaten oh, up, aren't you? It happened. Just the way it was on that page. I found came true. It knew. So dark. It'll come back for me. You must... The lights. In the office. I have the key. Okay, Rusty. Hang on. I'll be right back. I don't think he survived that did long. This couldn't be far. Rusty had found a page from the manuscript. Hmm, revolver. It would help me understand what had happened. Okay. Hello, Max. Shh, good boy. Can I shoot the dog? Ha ha ha! I can as well, but the bullets go right through him, so that's no fun. Animal cruelty wouldn't be condoned in this game. Can I open this now? No. Right. I guess I'm just gonna have to go to that office, aren't I? Ah, rest in peace, Rev. A moment of silence for the Rev. The only way to make sure that I said a moment of silence was to get the power running and the lights back on. Okay, okay, if we must unlock. Open me. I mean, open sesame. Sorry, didn't finish my sentence properly. You know what? I'm just tired today. I really am been at college 9 till 5 in fact it was more like 9 till half 5 because I didn't get home until like half 5 uh, yeah it's a long day tomorrow 9 till 3 Thursday half 9 till 4 I think so yeah long long week but I get a long weekend so I can get drunk on Saturday night lovely right manuscript page what does it say Wake reaches a safe haven of light. At the last instant, I changed direction and threw myself down. The axe splintered the trunk of a tree. I stumbled into the pool of bright light. My lungs burned. I was too exhausted to move. I tensed as I waited for the killing blow, but it never came. Excuse me. I raised my head. Nothing moved in the darkness beyond. For the moment, bathed in the cold light, I was safe. Hmm, I don't know where that comes into the story, but it obviously will at one point. So let's go in here. Oh, what did, what was that? Oh, I just knocked the chair. Uh, that's all right then. Um, 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 um. Hum, dead, hum, dead, hum. What's in here? Open. 
batteries and revolver ammo. Lovely jubbly. Ah, oh, don't like enclosed spaces in gas. Oh, oh that was God, that scared me. Someone had destroyed the circuit breaker. There Damn no it! To get the lights back on. Stupid axe. Oh my God. Oh no, it's come back for him. Rusty, 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 rusty spanner, rusty spanner person, I'm coming. I'm obviously too late, but I'm coming anyway, because I want to die too. With oily patches that look like liquid darkness. Ugh. Let's blow that darkness away. Oh, God, more of these. Bugger off. Don't you throw your answers at me. Shoot the guy! Right, okay. All these oily patches are what the Dark Presence has left behind. You don't need to get rid of them, but if you stand on them, they hurt you. So don't do that. If they're in your way, obviously get rid of them. And the wind has picked up, because there's beasties around. It's very dark in there, I don't really want to go in here, but I will do. Because it's part of the starry line. Alright. I have to go over here. Oh, great, a trail of blood. Something had torn a mammoth-sized hole in the wall. A ma a ma a, a mammoth a mammoth sized hole in the wall. Oh, the mammoth's still there, so it wasn't that. He had to say mammoth and it means something it, I, I mean he said mammoth, it has to mean something. Lovely blood blood on the window there. And the dog is gone. The dog is gone. Don't feed the animals. Where are you, Mr. Axe? Okay. Where are you? Where are? Oh, there you are. Oh no, it's Rusty. Rusty is a shadow guy now. Come here, Rusty. Let me kill you again. For a second time. No, actually, back off. Ha, ha, ha. Shoot you. Oh no, reload quick. Actually, you know what? Oh, what? I don't have my shotgun anymore. That fails. Epically. Sorry, Rusty. It had to be done. You were just too rusty for your own good. Oh my god, what's that? Oh, just shadow people. That's okay then. Let's pick up some revolver ammo. Oh, there's loads of it. Nice. Ah! I walked into... I walked into that one. Back off! Please. You and your knife are no match for me and my torch. My invincible shadow killing torch. Any manuscript pages around here? There's a big rock here. There should be something hiding behind it. Obviously not. Oh well. Okay. Let's go through here. Which the shadow people... Oh no, more shaking, more shaking, more shaking! And there's trees getting knocked down over there in the background. That's lovely. Please stay away from me, Mr. Dark Presence. I don't want to talk to you, because you're evil. Visitor Center, uh, yeah, that way, yeah. Um, I'm afraid you're in a bit of bad luck if you want to go there. There's a light. Checkpoint. Yay! Right. Wait, is there anything up here? No. For some reason I expected a manuscript page. Oh, I'm ringing. I'm vibrating. Who's there? What? What the hell was that? I saw it from the window. I saw it. I saw something. Forget about it, Barry. It's just me going crazy. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. You're not crazy. I wish you were crazy. But you're not crazy. Ow. Be careful. Stay in the cabin. Don't open the door for anyone. I mean it. Yes, mummy. Alright. Okay. Let's go exploring. Go exploring through the woods. How about that, darlings? Let's do it. Oh no, don't fall. Please. Please don't fall. Please don't fall, I said. Alright. There's a platform there which I can't get on. So, let's try going up here. No, there's nothing here. By the looks of things. Oh. I fell. Oh well, let's just carry on. 
go down the path to that light over there. Oh, there's a man. No, there's not. It's a signpost. I have glasses as well. Obviously, they're not good enough. Sorry, guys. My mistake. Oh, manuscript page. These manuscript pages are quite interesting. Really. Alright. Rusty's final thoughts. In that last instant of consciousness, Rusty thought about Rose. He was older than she was. Rose was barely out of her teens. But she made him feel young and forget what a train wreck his long dead marriage had been. He still wore the ring. He'd been waiting for her to tell him to take it off. Now she never would. Aww. Oh well. Shame. There's the tree that got knocked over, I'm guessing. If you can see that down there. I must again praise the graphics in this game. I mean, my TV, I'm not playing in HD because I can't record with the Dazzle if it's in HD for some reason, but it comes out as HD. No. Is it HD? What am I talking about? It's either HD or something else, I can't remember. I'm pretty sure it's HD. Yeah, it comes out as HD on YouTube. It might not seem like it because my, I compress it a different way to most people would because I've been taught how to do it that way. I use uh, um, virtual dub to turn it from um, VOB file to AVI and I compress it with the FF something something. I don't know. You know what? I have no idea what I'm on about. And then I put it through Camtasia Studio to mix the uh, audio and video together and then I just YouTube it it's quite a long process it takes about an hour maybe an hour and a half for one video to be put up on YouTube Lover's so Peak yeah is at the far end of the nature trail it's quite a long process right Lover's Peak is right this arrow is pointing left so let's go left entering Moonshine Cave hmm interesting I don't like caves especially in dark games like this oh God, it's a cave. It really is a cave. Fine. More arrows on the rock there, which you can barely see anyway. Saying so go this way. I wonder what kind of paint they use. Fluorescent. I don't know. I don't know paint. Moonshine Cave. This cave was the site of frequent and lucrative bootlegger activity throughout the prohibit. Throughout the. I can't read that. It was mostly used for temporary storage of alcohol smuggled from Canada, but at times alcohol was also distilled on the premises. Lovely. Piece of inf- Ah, bats, go away. What's this up here? Shotgun, yay! And another flare, I'm guessing that means. Yeah, oh wait, no, lithium batteries. Well, I guess that just means supply box then. Anyway, let's carry on. So, oh, I've just realised the parts at 13 minutes 30 now so I'm going to have to end it pretty soon in like a minute I'll just scan this area and then I will uh, do another part just for you guys because I love you yep nothing in here so let's exit just a shotgun <sighs> wonder if we'll see that scary woman again soon I hate those flashbacks. That's some of the things that, you know, there's flashbacks where it like goes into the water and it makes those horrible noises. Well, yeah, those are some of the creepy cutscenes I was talking about in the earlier parts. Oh, they scare me. Ugh, shivered. Sorry, someone walked over my grave. Alright, guys. That was part 11, I think, but I have not a clue. I've really lost track now. Yeah, it was. It was. No. What? Yeah, it's part 11. Right, yeah, part 11. Right, tune in for part 12. Should be up soon. Goodbye. Hehehe. <laughs>